everybody welcome to my channel if you're new thanks for tuning in i'm going to do my first attempt to uh complete a wash and go on my hair um and i have some new products that i'm going to be testing out to do this look um some of them are new some of them are things i always use so what i'm going to use as my moisturizer is just some regular old, um african shea butter um that i ordered um online and this is 100 pure for skin and hair haven't used this yet, so this is how it looks spread out the pack. I'm going to use that. I've already put my oil mix on my actual scalp already, so that's already been um, marinating. I'm also going to use this new thing that I've never tried before. My best friend told me to buy this and try it. It's the new Ampro Pro Style Curl Enhancer. It says it's a gel activator for extra dry hair, free of alcohol, parabens, protein, and dyes. Enhanced with aloe and olive oil. I actually got this on Amazon for $2.95. And I will put the link in the bottom of the description about this one. But she gets hers uh, from Walgreens. So um, I did find this. this is actually a 10 ounce container. And so it's just like a gel, jelly, gel, you know, whatever. Um, so I'm, I'm going to test that out as well. And I'm actually going to spray my hair with, like I always do with my aloe vera juice. And then I do have a spray bottle of water in case when my hair starts getting dry, I can put the spray the water on it. I'm also going to use my um, Denman brush uh, to help, you know, enhance the curls as I go. And we'll see how this goes. I'm going to use the diffuser at the end to see if that helps the curls stay and yada yada. So let's get into it. I'm going to turn around and show you guys the back. I'm going to pull this up into a little ponytail. My hair is pretty much wet because I've just of course you know cleansed it so my hair is wet um and i guess i think with my hair it will have to be like dripping wet for this to work and i have to have the right product i don't know why my hair like my hair is so many different textures i feel like that's the reason why my hair does never does not really do well with washing goes like i have to either do twist out or something like that for it to the curls to pop and actually look like something but we're going to see what this curl enhancer is talking about. So what I'm going to do is spray my hair with the aloe vera juice first. Um, like I would if I was doing a twist out um, and dampen it with that. Then I'm going to go in next with the shea butter because my hair loves shea butter. Um, only thing about shea butter is it's, well, when it comes in this form. If it's not whipped then it's kind of hard to rub, I mean, you know, melt down some. But I'm going to just put shea butter on my palms and rub it through my hair like so. Make sure I get the ends because they be dry. Because that's the oldest part of your hair, so it gets the driest quickest. Just put that on. And I'm going to rub that, I mean, not rub, I'm going to brush that in. Um... First, before I get to the curl enhancer gel, brush this in. Ooh, water flinging everywhere. And as you can see, even with just the the shea butter, my curls are already coming through. And defining. But I am going to go through and kind of, when I put the activator on, I think I'm going to try to separate my, not separate, but I'm going to do more of a finger coil to kind of help. So I'm going to turn around and show you how the back looks without the curl enhancer on so you can know before and after. So this is how it looks without, that's without the curl enhancer. So let's see what happens once I put the curl enhancer on and I'm going to do small little sections of it just because I want to see if it really works so I'm going to just rake it through this little small section here from the root to the tips just kind of see what happens Okay, I'm think I'm I'm thinking I'm going to have to finger. Well, this one 
I mean, this part did kind of start curling up quickly. Um, but this part did not. So what I'm going to do is just finger curl, coil this one and then just let it kind of see what it is. All right, so I'm going to do the, put this in my whole section back here. Now here, as you can see, the front part of my hair um, is on the left side is more loose than the rest of my hair. So here I'm having to really kind of be really baby in these curls and kind of figure co uh, coiling them very, very um, thin and thin sections because that part of my hair doesn't really curl as easily as the back does and neither does the middle, like the top crown of my hair. But that's just how it looks all around and see that front part. <laughs> those curls are just so limp so here i'm going to use my diffuser shout out to my bestie brickney for sponsoring this diffuser for me uh shout out to you whoop, whoop. um i really really never had used a diffuser before so this is actually my first time trying it and here you just see me um lifting the curls and putting the uh, putting them on the diffuser so that it can dry my hair faster because my hair naturally takes a long time to dry because I have low porosity hair, so it takes a lot of time to dry, especially when I have product on it. Um, so here I'm just scrunching my curls up and drying them. I did not dry them completely, like 100% dry. By the time I got done and uh, being tired of doing this, it was probably about 85 90% dry. part of my hair I'm not going to judge the gel on this part of my hair because my I haven't found anything to to make this this part of my hair um as curly as the rest it's just the way it grows out of my scalp so I'm not really judging it on this on this side but it still has like a little bit of curl here you know this this part of my hair is very loose um loosely curled so I really can't say that the gel Oh, it doesn't work because it's part of my hair. Like, I never judge just this little section of my hair. But as you can see, this side is extremely defined. And that's just the way that my hair grows. So, I, I really don't know what to do about that. Or, I don't know, maybe put some curl activator or something on this side, whatever. Anyway, I feel like I really, 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 really like this gel. My hair is extremely soft. It moves. It's not um, stiff or, you know, like crunchy is very soft and fluffy and it bounces and moves and i really think i will continue to to use this um curl enhancer 
um, by Ampro, the styling, the Pro Style Gel. Um, and I feel like it'll be one of my staples from now on um, until I find something that maybe is even better than that. I don't know. So you guys give me any comments, suggestions, or questions in the bottom of the description box. And let me know what you think about this gel if you've tried it. Um, if you think I need to do a different type of technique or try something different with it, um, let me know. And I will see you guys in my next video. And thanks for tuning in. So, thank you. Bye.